always contact the sellers before your appointment and go over the pre-listing interview. It is absolutely necessary because it will help you better prepare for the appointment. It will give you more insight into their situation, their motivation, and it will clarify their core reason to move. A pre-listing interview demonstrates to the client your genuine care about them and their situation. It puts you in control. You are in the driver's seat, remember? You will find out all the critical details you must know before you meet them in person. Pre-qualification over the phone clarifies their motivation and their core driving emotion. You will find out who your competition is, and it helps you stand out and establishes you as a pro. The pre-listing call starts a mental shift in the seller's mind from listing to selling and moving. The call will often allow you to be the last agent in the seller's interview, which is frequently the best position to be in. After interviewing several agents, most sellers are more realistic about the price, bored with long presentations by other agents, so your presentation will be like a breath of fresh air, very different, and they are ready to make a decision. Many tests have now proven that products, items, and people shown last are significantly more likely to be selected than any other choice. For example, on American Idol, the contestants who perform last are far more likely to advance to the next round and, in fact, to win the overall competition. How is that possible? The sales and influence expert Kevin Hogan has the answer. People usually withhold their evaluation until they have seen all the options available and evaluate the last presented, most recent option first. Being the last agent is usually the strongest position that gives you the best chance to score a great listing. The danger, of course, is that another agent snags the listing before you meet the sellers. So here is a little script that will take care of it. You'll say, other agents will try to close you before we get a chance to meet. It's because they don't know or they don't want to do all the marketing I offer. So they figure if you don't know about it, you will not ask for it. Would you please hold off on listing with another agent until we meet? That way you'll have all the information you need to make the right decision and pick the best agent. Will you promise me that? Great, thank you. I'm looking forward to meeting you. That's it, real simple. And now let's watch the pre-listing interview. All right, let's call the sellers. Mm -hmm. Hello, Jana. Uh, hi, hi, yes, it's me. Hi. Hi, it's Barino with Remax Real Estate. How are oh, you? Oh, good, good. How are you? I'm doing great. I just wanted to confirm our appointment for next Thursday. Mm -hmm. Do you have a moment? Can we chat real quick? I have a couple questions I wanted to ask real quick. Sure, sure. No problem. Go Excellent. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me a little bit about your plans? I know we chatted about it before. What's mm -hmm. the reason you guys are selling the house? Well, you know, my husband was offered a position as vice president um, and the company headquarters are in Denver. Oh, okay. Yeah, so he works uh, for a fit fitness corporation. Uh-huh. We used to live in Colorado before, so moving down there, you know, it's, you know, it actually feels natural. We awesome. Still have so it's like going home, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, we still fantastic. Have well, congratulations and... to Thank Brian. You. Thank you. That's really cool. <laughs> now, how important is it to you guys to sell the house? <laughs> Well, it's, it's really important. We we have to sell. You have to sell. You yeah. can't move and either rent the house out or stay where you are. No, no. We definitely, you know, there is an area in Denver we like, uh -huh. like prestigious neighborhood and lots of nice homes. Yeah. And, you know, kids friendly. So. Oh, cool. So you found a neighborhood that you like where you want to be? Yeah. We, we kind of think that's where we want to go. Excellent. <laughs> and how soon would you like to be there, Jana? Well, uh, we need to be there in four months. Four months. So mm -hmm. s the house needs to sell and you would like to move in four months. Yeah. That's doable. Have you found a particular house that you like yet? Well, we've been looking, but we haven't uh -huh. found one yet. Nothing. We still, you know, I guess we need to sell this one first. <laughs> right. Now, and what if you don't find one? Do you have a place to stay? Have you thought about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we you know, we can stay at my sister. Oh, okay. Uh, for a while if we have to. Gotcha. So okay. That would, that less pressure, right? Less true, stress. True. <laughs> Good for you. Now, please tell me a little bit about your house. Your public tax records show it's a four bedroom, two mm -hmm. full baths, yeah. and then a half a bath. Mm -hmm. And 2,560 square feet. Does it sound about right? Yes, that sounds correct. That sounds correct. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. How long have you lived there? Uh, we've been we've been here for six years, I think. Six years. Good for you. All mm -hmm. right. <laughs> Are there any repairs you'd like to get done before it sells? Um, I don't think so. Maybe maybe you can tell us. But I okay. think the house is in a great shape. Good shape. <laughs> All right. Fantastic. Any additions with or without permits? No, no, we haven't done any additions. Nothing. Okay, mm -mm. good.
Have you done any remodeling recently? Not really. The, well, the last thing we've done was uh, build building grill outside. Oh, nice. Yeah. Outdoor grill. Very <laughs> cool. Brian must love that, huh? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Excellent. What is the balance on your mortgage? Um, I think it's 365, but I can double check that. 365. Okay, we'll verify that. No big deal. Any potential issues or problems that you can think of? No, I don't think so. Nothing. Okay. Mm. Excellent. Now, as far as the price, mm -hmm. I will put together a detailed market evaluation. I'll go over everything when I see you guys. But mm -hmm. give me an idea. Ideally, what would you consider a fair price for your house? Oh, let's see. <laughs> we would like you to give us your opinion. Sure, sure. No, and I will, of course. But can you give me at least a ballpark? What would you like to get for it? Well, I'd say we need to sell it for at least 700. Okay, 700. That mm -hmm. sounds fair. Excellent. All right. Yeah. Now, what is more important to you guys? Time it'll take to sell and close or the sales price? Both, I'd say. Both, Both. are okay. very important for us. Both. Mm -hmm. All right. Which concerns you the most when it comes to selling the house? Well, there, you know, are there any things we, mm, we should do or fix? Uh -huh. And the price? You yeah, know, we need to get as much as possible. Yeah, so are those the things you'd like to talk about when I see you? Uh, the repairs or suggested repairs and... Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, well, you know, like, let's say, how will you get the house sold? What advertising you mm -hmm. do and how much, how much will you charge? <laughs> yes. Okay, so the marketing and advertising of the house mm -hmm. and the commission. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, excellent. Uh, are you planning on interviewing other agents? Uh, yes, there uh, there is one lady coming tonight, mm -hmm. Martha uh, Goodstein. Do you know her? Oh yes, Martha Goodstein, very good agent, excellent mm -hmm. choice. Yeah. How will you choose the agent you're going to go with? Well, I guess the, you know, the <laughs> someone you we like and uh -huh. the, who's a hard worker and uh -huh. someone we can trust. Uh -huh. I guess that's important to us. Gotcha. Someone you like, someone mm -hmm. who will get the job done, <laughs> and trust. Very good. Is there anything else? Um, I'm sorry? Is there anything else? Anything mm -hmm. else about the agent that matters to you guys? No. Or is that it? Well, you know, just a mutual feeling. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. Excellent. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to seeing you both on Thursday. Mm -hmm. Is there anybody else other than you and Brian that's involved in the, who is involved in the sale? No, no, just my husband. Just the two of you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, we'll go over all the information and we should be done in about 30 minutes or so. Is that okay? Will you have enough time? Absolutely. Yeah. Excellent. Yes. Now, we will be putting an information packet together for you. You should have it in just a couple of days. Please take a moment and read through it, okay? We will. Thank you. Excellent. And I'll call you one more time just to confirm the appointment. Meanwhile, is there anything else I should have asked today but I didn't? Mm, no, I think that covers it covers it all. Thank okay, you. very good. Well, if something does come up, just give me a ring, okay? You have my number. Okay. One last thing before I let you go. I wanted to ask you a favor. I'm going to prepare for our meeting as soon as we get off the phone today. Uh -huh. Would you please hold off on listing with another agent until we meet? That way you'll have all the information you need to make the right decision and pick the best agent. Will you promise me that? Sure. Okay, great. Yana, thank you so much. I'm really looking forward to meeting you on Thursday. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. And that's all there is to it. Easy, right? Mm -hmm.